Good afternoon from the Dubai Air Show. My name is Tim Flood. I'm the International Business Development Director for Mobility and Surveillance, which includes the KC-46 tanker you see behind me here. Uh, a few things about the tanker. It's a Legacy 767-derived aircraft. It's a multi-mission tanker capable of refueling both hose and drogue and boom, as well as uh, carriage of passengers, cargoes, and aeromedical evacuation capability. Uh, we're very proud uh, of the partnership with the US Air Force and I can acknowledge them for bringing this tanker here to, to showcase it for our, both our customers and the media. The aircraft is uh, uh, performing well. We've so far conducted over 5,000 sorties with the aircraft, delivered over 50 million pounds of, uh, of gas, um, and we've delivered 51 aircraft to date, 50 to the US Air Force, and our first delivery to Japan was, uh, was last month. I'm looking forward to delivering more. US Air Force placed an order for, uh, we'll have a program of record for 179 aircraft, and uh, we also see increasing demand internationally. Uh, Japan has placed an order for four aircraft, uh, the first of which I just mentioned was delivered uh, last month. And we're also uh, in uh, discussions with the Israeli Air Force, who've also uh, indicated strong demand for the aircraft as well. We do see this as uh, an ongoing opportunity for, in the international marketplace for anybody looking for uh, a, a, a truly proven combat tanker transport aircraft. It's the only inline produced aircraft of its kind in the world and benefits from all the investment and interoperability with the US Air Force. And uh, for an Air Force like Indian Air Force, where you have varied terrains in India, how good would a KC-46 tanker be? So we think this would be an ideal solution for the Indian Air Force um, and you know, they've they have expressed interest in procuring tankers in the near future and we look forward to having ongoing dialogue with, uh, with the Indian Air Force and we see huge advantages both leveraging off this is going to be the single largest fleet of tankers in the world so in terms of interoperability and supportability and affordability by leveraging off a larger uh, larger fleet like the uh, US Air Force that has huge benefits to the Indian Air Force and we think that would be uh, an ideal fit for them. And what is the response to it at the Dubai Air Show from the Middle East region? There's been a lot of strong interest in the aircraft and we're very grateful to US Air Force again who's been hosting uh, official delegates to come and look at the aircraft so we are seeing uh, ongoing uh, strong interest and demand and we look forward to that manifesting into, into future orders. Thank you so much, Lynn. Thank you very okay. much. My pleasure.